Uh, greeting viewers, continuing the case study of Nissan horn problem. Now we will uh, hook up our multimeter across our relay and we will check whether we are getting voltage or not. As we checked previously that this relay is getting latch without pressing the horn button switch. Now This click sound we can observe. Moving on, we will hook up our multimeter across its terminal. This is the positive terminal, it's 3 pin relay basically. Here is the positive terminal, then it is uh, connected with this one and this is negative. So when this relay is latched, it passes power to horn. Now checking the voltage across this its terminal, I turn on my multimeter on DC scale, DC 12 volt. Now I am connecting my meter across it. Positive will go here. I don't believe on spreading the legs of relay pins, but we don't have other choice because I don't have field wine over here. Now connecting here, our meter is reading 12.98 volt which is full battery voltage battery terminal voltage it determines that our switch is pressed condition although it is not pressed but the voltage is appearing across the relay terminal so it is stating that our switches have some problem our switch is switch is for sure mal operating malfunctioning and it is it keep on the relay this is the second test easily by this test easily one can determine whether i am getting voltage across this relay it is genuine genuinely operated or not so in our case this is a false these are these are false voltage and actually the switch is not pressed so by this way we can check our uh, voltage across the relay terminal thank you very much for watching